Good morning and welcome back. My name is Eric Avalos. I have two special guests in the house with me today. Elaine Hicks. Elaine Hicks from the Humane Society and the beautiful olive oil. Now, if you were salivating with all those Oreos up there, nothing is better than dipping your Oreos in a little bit of olive oil. That's a bad <laughs> joke. <laughs> but this dog's name is Olive Oil. She is one years old and super calm, super lovable puppy. Um, I am just, uh, since she's been in the studio, she has not barked once. She's just a lovely, lovely puppy. Can you tell us more about this puppy? Yeah, Olive came to us about a month ago from um, the Oklahoma Correctional Facility. She has her basic training. She knows how to sit, stay, shake, um, very well mannered, crates up really well. And right. she, she loves to play, she loves her toys, good around dogs, good around children. And, and as you can see, she is she's really mellow. Yeah, super mellow dog. I, I, you know, um, I've been around some dogs that are just, you know they're gonna be a handful. This dog is gonna be a good companion. Like, she's just, she likes to have fun when she, like, I could imagine if you were to throw a ball right now, she would love to play fetch and, and love to play ball and stuff like that, run outside, get the exercise, but then come back inside and just cuddle with you on the couch and be a snuggle bug. I could see that being a thing. Absolutely. Again, you can see how chill she is, basically. Yeah. And again, she has those basic manners, which really takes a lot of uh, um, the training, which is important for any dog. So just having the basics really makes her very adoptable and she just really needs a home where she could run and play and, and again, be that lovable companion. Yeah, I can't think of any time when I have not been without a home in my entire life. This dog has been without a home for some time now. We need to get her a home and your home could be the home. Look at that little puppy. Oh my goodness, cute dog, big ears, big heart. Um, so how can they, they get this dog? How could, like, if they're watching right now and they're like, oh my God, that is the dog for me. How can we get this dog? Just come on down to the Rock County Humane Society. We mm. open at noon. Come visit her. Come spend some time with her. Take her for a walk. Play with her. You can do all those things? Yeah, you sure can. Oh. You sure can. And if you can't adopt, then you can also come volunteer and do the same thing. Help her socialize, get out, yeah. give her a refresher course on her manners. Um, nice. Again, perfect dog. It's a great dog. Perfect. Great dog. She looks a little thin. Is that is she? Is she gonna chunk up a little bit, or is that kind of good? At, at, no, absolutely. She yeah. she does need to gain a few pounds. Okay. Um, you know, she has a lot of energy, and and so she does run around when when she's outside yeah. a lot. So, um, and, and shelter life is just hard. Yeah. It's stressful. It's not a life for anybody. Right. Um, so. The past couple weeks, we've had a couple different animals on. Can mm -hmm. you tell? Can you speak to those animals? Bruce Wayne is still with us. He, she, um, or he needs, he still needs a home. Um, he's doing well. And then Baloo, our our special needs kitty, last week um, does have a choice hold on him. Hey. So hopefully he's going to get to go home pretty soon. So so far, guys, we're hitting one out of three. So that's not <laughs> that's, bad at all. No, that's it's not. Thirty-three percent. And so like, let's get this dog into a forever home. Awesome. Thank you. Yes. Before we leave, I'd like to talk to you a little bit about how to get. Uh, the, the if your dog is lost can you speak to that real quick yeah sure if your dog is lost check our website routehumane.org and also check our Facebook page yes. because we post all of our lost dogs on there yes. um, and if you are missing dog call us and, and we can let you know right then and there um, if you're from one of the smaller towns and have animal control you can also call animal control to see if they've picked up a dog that's similar to yours but always come down in person and look and number one rule is please microchip and identify your dogs awesome. and cats yeah well we're gonna do that if you lose your animal go check it out Thank you so much for tuning in. Thank you so much for coming on air. I really appreciate it. And Olive Oil, thank you so much for attending as well. Oh, thank you all around. Thank you, Summit <laughs> County. Thank you, Steamboat. And uh, this has been The Morning Boat with Eric Ablos. We will see you tomorrow morning with more things to do in Steamboat Springs. Back to you, Summit. <laughs>